The 15th of August every year is commemorated by Catholics the world over as the day that the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Jesus, was assumed body and soul into heaven. The Solemnity of the Assumption, commonly known as Big de Maria in the ecclesiastical province of Bamenda in Cameroon. As in Rome and elsewhere, Mass too was celebrated in the Sacred Heart Cathedral by His Excellency Agapitus Mfon. Bishop of the Diocese of Kumba. Mass started at 6.30 a.m. with the liturgy led by the mothers of the Catholic Women Association, the CWA. Homily, the bishop explained the difference between the ascension of Jesus into heaven and the assumption, making also a distinction between the English verb to assume, that is, causing something to be true, though not certain. Tracing the teachings of the fathers of the church, especially St. John Damascene, it is but fitting and proper that one who was without sin be honored to have been taken up into heaven body and soul. Before, during, and after birth, he gave a better honor for King God of the And people want to God say, person with a body without original birth, the purest of all creatures, and we don't even do any personal birth, can you say to be immaculate? Immaculate conception is just correct. Say, may God 
take it for heaven, body and soul, where the body is not rotten. Will not it not happen for a body? Because you know we do no bad. Immaculate conception. Mary is the proto-Christian, the proto-disciple. She gives us an example to be perfect disciples of her son. As brothers and sisters of Jesus, Mary is our mother, the bishop said, and we are her children. So we must live lives so that we can be where she is, God's own people. We must avoid sin. The bishop explained the seven heads of the dragon representing the seven capital sins we must avoid. Pride, covetousness, lust, anger, gluttony, envy, and sloth, spiritual laziness. Now anger, now don't say anger is a bad thing. Now what Mr. Vitor say, if you vex, before one cut something, or before one do something, count one to ten, you know, we'll do that same thing. So anger is one of the capital sins there, we now one of that head them for that dragon. Another one is gluttony. Gluttony is not it. You chop pass away your beloved carrier. You drink pass away your beloved carrier. Any person will say you don't drunk, that gluttony that. You don't hear anyone that envy. Capital says envy. For look what a man is doing, you back out. Sometimes you walk out, you say man is fine. Sometimes bring start bring which for inside. It'd be like that story for for inside Bible when Jesus talks to some man in the soul he'll be weak for far. I want for for grow now and then you see all that grass there inside when you plant that grass. Grass will grow inside past the weak in system. Then you see that some bad man and some wicked man, some evil man can't plant that. Person, plenty of people that get that evil for envy with the bad heart, all that people there. Look and I do Rosaria here, one for where any man will can't take. Some people that they have the one for take three. When the same man take one, 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 you will see some person who want to take three. Now that covetousness, now that greed. Mama Maria could be get up. And now one of the capital sin and that greed. If we suffer for, for Africa, now greed for other countries then. Like France, when they hear this time, our country them for Africa, they defy France and all that one. How do they want to say you get independent? But all the riches were on the ground, they belong to France. Cameroon and France. How you will do? She don't be a whole country. God don't bless you, you are going. You will open eyes to other one you go. That one agree. Now capital say. And if you grab all this man palava or woman palava, lost. If you don't manage, stay with your woman. We don't get back. Angel don't tell us you go born God. You know she don't like some queen. And I want to get outside gospel. What do you do? He takes you for go to a country for Judah. For go visit a cousin Elizabeth. That one of humility. Some of we want no high chair. Sometimes they will have a sister that they don't put some big chair for inside government. You need to know now so say me only man in camp can visit you. Anything where it happen for we now by the grace of God. And number seven one is sloth. Sloth it means say laziness, indifference. Think for God we won't get interest. For prayer we won't get interest. For come for church like big day Maria so we not get interest. For soul we won't get interest. Anything for do for church we won't get interest. We lazy. That one is sloth. The bishop encouraged and exhorted all to pray the rosary and trust in Mary's powerful intercession. What in one hand? May we not play with that rosary. We will not play with her. My dear people of God, my mama and me are to get the power of intercession. If we have it for all things, now we have been glad to get it for Sunday. For the audience for, 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 for Rome. Papa for Roma again, he begs him in prayer for Cameroon. Made a prayer for Cameroon with him for more now for seven years. Say, so make a course for negotiation, it be possible. He not just talk about peace. Say, so make prayer, say, so make harmony. Make true negotiation, it be. He equally thanked the Palotin fathers. 
who dedicated this country, Cameroon, under the patronage of Our Lady, Queen of the Apostles. The bishop also mentioned Pope Francis's Sunday Angelus prayer, where he mentioned prayer for peace in Cameroon. Let us also be ready to forgive, the bishop said. What made this year's celebration even more colorful was the Thanksgiving Mass of Reverend Sisters Mary Francis and Helen of the Tertiary Sisters of St. Francis, who were celebrating, thanking God for 50 years of consecrated life. Then came the closing of the Vocations Collection. Each year, on the 15th of August, the Vocations Collection comes to a close, collection that the Christians of the diocese make to support the training of priests. The bishop also expressed his gratitude to the Christians who never failed to support in contributing towards the training of seminarians. Dear people of God, Mama Maria to the Mama for Father there. I will support the work of vocation, make it go before. I want to begin up a thank to my all. Since this diocese will start for 2016, we don't show myself for this diocese. So when it comes to the formation of a future Father them, do not be joke. Immediately when we start, we will only be a few months old, not we even come last set for seminary collection. We push like three dice in them for back. That first year we did like number two. That time for crisis, crisis don't set in. And since then, Cambridge today, every year with the increased vocational collection, with the grow now, the grow all time. And any time when I stand for here, this basket or this pan, in a heavy pass. I hope say today I will beg myself that they can support me for all of So I want to thank you plenty for the wonderful support you have given for me. As one well, knows, I want to talk. If not be me, I don't feel do anything. My power, my riches, my everything, now all will have Christian level inside the diocese of Umba. And I want to talk, say, God be blessed with our prayer. We will continue to pray for more vocation. Not be only for father, but also for sister and for brother. This year, when I'm not believe, we send 17 young boys there for Vianney Center. 
but begin their seminary formation now, seriously, from the Diocese of Pumba, 17 of them. You know, we don't ever have to It's well that ends well. And that was how Big Day Maria was celebrated in the Diocese of Kumba. We all know that uh, today is Big Day Maria. It's a very significant day in the ecclesiastical province of Bamenda. The solemnity of the Assumption and the people normally will prepare very well. What is very significant in this province, besides the celebration and glory that our Mother Mary is taking up to heaven, body and soul, we all as devotees of the Blessed Virgin Mary are hoping and we have the faith that where our mother is, a mother who is so caring and so loving, we will also be tomorrow if we follow her example. And so I'm so happy with the attendance of Mass today and the activity of the various Marian groups at least I, I think it's a wonderful thing and our people know that Mary has a very great role to play in our lives and for our salvation as, as well. Since she's the co-mediatrix, she is the first disciple he wants us all to be. And um, I was also very happy that we are all aware of the fact that we need to encourage the formation of our priests in the ecclesiastical province. So today, in almost all our dioceses, we are closing seminary collection. So it's very significant to know that Mary is also a mother of priests and she encourages formation of priests, good priests for that matter. So I would like to thank all the Christians for the wonderful preparation of this solemnity of Assumption. And I pray that they will not only end there, they will continue with their devotion to the Blessed Virgin Mother because she is a wonderful support for us and she will always intercede get tired praying to her. Well, to the Christian community, my message to them is that they should not forget praying the rosary. We have a great intercessor, our mother Mary, who is in heaven, queen of heaven. We can never turn to her and not have what we need. Would he celebrate the big day Maria? When are the day where Papa God will be taken? Mommy Maria for heaven, body and soul. So today with them and um, um, mothers and for CWA we will celebrate with other Christians and um, make this day, forgive the day the grand day where it is. The Feast of Assumption, celebrating it in the Kumba Cathedral has been very wonderful. It is a day really to thank God for 
our mother Mary, whom he has taken to heaven, body and soul. And we know that she is taking all our petitions to present to God. As a mother, she knows best how to do it. Our bishop, Agapitus Vaughan, has been a very good shepherd, just beginning the Kum, uh, Bam, uh, Kumba Diocese. He is laying a good foundation, and we are very happy that the priests, the religious, and the lay faithful are working hand in hand with him to promote the growth of this diocese. And we are sure that God will continue to bless this diocese and it will be a model for others to follow. So Jesus, we are the cadet of Sacred Parish. Today we are celebrating the Assumption of Our Lady into Heaven and the Crown of Our Lady, Mother and Queen of Earth. 